For all you mad bastards loving the Big Show podcast, get up even closer on Instagram, YouTube, and TikTok, or Raw Dog It, four to seven every weekday on Radio Horaki. Yeah, yeah man. boy. Oh, yeah, yeah, man. For sure, for sure. Oh, yeah. man. Hey, Dad. Mogi. Yeah, man. Um, you still on the durries? Uh, I'm hey, back he, off them again, man. Oh, I'm actually going through the last couple of days, a bit of depression, actually. Yeah, I understand. Uh, I'm just drinking too much piss. Sure. And I don't mean getting up, you know, staying up late or blah, 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 but I know I just need to stop drinking. Yeah. Because when I drink, I smoke. Yes. And so I'm actually at a point now where I've been banging on about it, and I normally never do this. I normally say it and then I do it. And I just got a real period of of self loathing at the moment. Like, <laughs> yes, sure. what are you doing? You know what you need to do. Stop being a useless. See you next Tuesday. <laughs> do you know what I mean? And yes. that that really came over me probably Sunday and yesterday. Yes. Um, and then yeah. So I've just, yesterday was day one, Jason. In other words, yeah. Um, I got the missus to pour water on my last packet of cigarettes. Um, so we'll see what kind of a hoor of a mood I am. I normally don't get too angry, but I am just gutted with myself, eh? It's so weak. Yes. Weak. Well, no, look, it's not. It is. Uh, um, it but is. I know, but I know what you mean. Yeah. Uh, let me just say I know what you mean. And, um, you know, particularly for people like you and I who drink the way we do, Yeah. there's no sparing the horses, Pugs. Um, there's not what I've – well, although I am, I'm not what I used to be in that regard. I'm a lot better, but it's just like everything about it. You just need a, anything like that. You've got to have a break, and if there's no break, yeah. it's hard to appreciate it. I, uh, I reached that point over the holidays too where I went, you know what? You know, if you, I've, I've, I've got to stop doing shit that's killing me. Yeah, you know right. what I mean. I've, I know, but I've, yeah. I've got to stop doing it. And interestingly enough, you know, we had a, I had a counselling session today, as I mm. do on the Tuesday. Hell yeah! Um, and you know, going about dealing with stuff like I, I perpetually have chronic anxiety, even mm. though I. I seem like a very chill, yeah. really oh, so laid chill, back, man. you know, oh high five. Hey, Hoity J's in the room. <laughs> sure. Hey, but I have chronic anxiety. And, like, I had that over the holidays where I was like, I'm done with this fucking shit. I need to start fucking dealing with it better. Was that the smoking? Yeah. Or and, the anxiety? Uh, the anxiety. But right. certainly the smoking. It's just been shockingly bad because the anxiety's been bad. And so, you know, when you're feeling bad. Are you on medication? No. Nah. Mm. Um, but when you're feeling bad, you do bad shit, like drink mm. and but smoke. But it's comfort, isn't it? it and is. I, and as soon comfort. as you said that, see, as soon as you said that, <laughs> um, as soon as you said, uh, you know, i got to stop doing shit that kills us. And we've been down this road. If you've been listening to this podcast for any length of time, you've heard this conversation yes. 50 times. Ad infinitum. But that you go, you go, well, what have I got? Then what have I got? Yeah. Where does the pleasure come from? Yes. Family? No. Yes. <laughs> uh, well, yes, but it's like, but you need, you do need something more. But my thing is, if you're taking a break, like with darts and drinking, if you're taking a break and it's now and again, then I think that's fine. But it's when it's every single day or yes. every single mm. weekend and it's affecting other things in your life. Yes. That's when I don't think. Oh, well, obviously you shouldn't be doing it. Yes. And and my my ceiling for that is a lot lower than most people's. Most people will go out, make a fool of themselves, pissed. Uh, black out, have anxiety and all of that, and they'll do that twice a weekend and they'll do it every weekend and then, uh, you know. Yes. But my limit is much lower because I already had that when I was much younger. Yes. Right. So I don't, and I've got too much on the go with things outside of radio and all of that sort of stuff where you're just like, man, you know, obviously you can't risk it. Yeah. And you can't it, risk it. And everything just becomes so hard. And I know that, um, you know, it's really interesting you know, where's the where's the fun part then? If I'm not doing the piss, if I'm not doing the ciggies, where's the fun part of my life? Yeah. But actually, like just talking for myself personally, those aren't actually fun for me anymore. Right. You know what I mean? I oh, know so, the piss definitely isn't. Um and it's like so I need to find other ways of having fun, which I've started to do with certain things. Um but you've got to take action. 
you got to take action on this shit. Yeah, and this is exactly mm. it. And so for me, I'm somebody that needs to have a very structured plan. So I can uh, I can say, oh, this is the idea about how I'd like things to go. But if I don't actually go five o'clock in the morning, get up and go to the gym. Yes. Yeah. Six o'clock in the morning, take my dog for a walk. Uh, seven o'clock, play with the kid until eight. Eight, o'clock. you know, if I don't have that kind of structure in place, yes, within three days, it's out the fucking window. Yeah, you yeah. forget about it, and you're just straight back into those old habits. I don't have, you can't do it from memory or no inclination or because you've got no muscle memory. Your muscle memory is, by, well, not you know, not a hundred percent, but as bad habits. Yes, you know, you just do these things and it's enough and blah blah blah. But I've just got to add a lot more structure. I was talking to the, um, the wife about it as well, and we we're both on the same page with it. But yeah, I just got into a real rut with it, just going. And I very rarely get down about things, very rarely. Yes, but I was yesterday, and I was fucking over it, and just because I'm gutted at myself. Yeah, and I will, you know. Today I was better about it, and tomorrow I'll be completely fine. But it is just, yeah, going going through that shit, and also, you know, when you do stop doing that stuff, you do actually naturally feel better. Oh well, then if I can if I can get through a weekend, I'll be yes. sweet. Yeah, yeah, that's and that's what's annoying. But then something will come up, and oh, that'll be fun. And then the other thing is, where am I? You know, it's where am I getting my fun? And then I'm doing this gym stuff, and I'm actually getting pretty much the same results as I was last year yes. when I drank no piss at all. Now I've found out I can actually drink piss and get the same results. It's oh, not good. Yeah. That's done. Yeah. The Horaki Big Show, weekdays from four on Radio Horaki. The Horaki Big Show podcast. The reason why I do that is because I want to know that I've got control over the addiction. Yep, now this sure. this time round, I haven't proven that I do. Yes, right. Yeah. So so it, there's some steps that it, need to be it's taken. It's a cunning little bastard, Pugsan. It's a yeah. cunning little bar. And it's, you know, and you add to it too um, the beautiful weather, the, you know, the oh, stuff like that, and yeah. parties and shit like that. It's, it's fuck. I, you know, during the summer, I always struggle. I used to. Used to always have to walk past the empire. Yeah, and there's always people out on a you know every night when you're yeah. walking to the car park with a massive glistening glass of yeah. lager, frosted, yeah. frosted yeah, yeah. lager, and you're like, Fuck. yeah. I always just imagine those people with horrendous home lives. It's like, yeah, that looks <laughs> yeah. good there, but what about when they go home in a fight with their missus yeah, and they're yeah, a fucking yeah. piece of shit tomorrow morning? You know, you gotta you gotta try and see the other project, side of it as well. Yeah. yeah, but totally. yeah, and if I had just stuck to what I said I was gonna do, I would have been coming into summer sweet. But yes. now, yeah, I've sort of, I guess I can still fit in six weeks or eight weeks, maybe even. What are we in? Ish. Anyway, yeah. Yes. So I've been over it. I've oh, been it's all over good, it. mate. I've seen you when you're on a mish, man. Oh, You'll yeah. fucking get there. Oh, yeah. That rigidity well, that's what's annoying that you, is it's, yeah. it's the first time I've ever not done it. Yeah. Yeah. Right. Every single time I say I'm going to do it and I do it. And this time, I don't know what it is. And maybe it's from having the businesses. Sure. And that's just seven days a week. You know, long, long hours, and I think I just need a valve. Yes. And drinking a couple of beers and smoking heaps of darts and having a laugh is pretty good. And it's easy. It doesn't yes. require me to catch up with other people. Yep. I can do it alone in my bedroom, pugs. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> That's a dream, baby. Yeah, you are, but you, you know, know it's just and like, you're it's, still as buff as fuck, you know what I mean? Yeah, so, yeah, yeah. Uh, mm. But it's like, but I'd, I should be... Playing golf, and I should be, yes. you know, it's it's funny these things that you dedicate your time to, right? You go, oh, okay, well, I'm gonna, I'm gonna get fit. If I'd have dedicated the same amount of time to learning Tadeo or learning guitar or going and playing golf or yes. catching up with mates, making those phone calls, I would have a a, a, a more fulfilled life. Right. Yes, in a different way, right? I could have done all of these other things. Correct. So it's not necessarily just doing the gym, although I think exercise is good for the mind. I think it's got to be, uh, yeah, other things have got to be on the plate, and maybe I'm over the gym. I don't know. Yeah, well, I'm going back to the gym tomorrow. Oh, yeah, enough. right. Fuck you, man. You're going, fucking enough. getting your perv back on. He's sick. I was a little bit there, actually. I saw that. <laughs> um, yeah. Uh, well, for me, it's like fishing and golf and stuff. Yeah, exactly. And, and, you do have those. And, and, yeah. and going out, you know, with my wife for dinner and going to movies and shit like that. Just getting out of the house and doing stuff is really important. And I've actually got quite good at that of going, no, no, 
no, no, you are going to go and do that. You're not going to fucking not do that. Well, that's the other thing. It's like me and the wife wanting to go out and stuff, but because we've got a young kid, every time you walk out the door, it costs you 100, 200 bucks (laughs) to get a babysitter. It's like, well, we're trying to save money. Yes. So then you can't do that. So then you don't go out. But then I was thinking about that on the way in because I got invited to some uh, movie premiere thingy or something. And I said, oh, do you want to go? And she goes, well, that's going to be 150, 200 bucks. So you're absolutely right. Mm. You stay home. I'm going. (laughs) Yes. You know, and we'll we'll swap them out, but you've got to get out of the fucking house. Yeah, totally, man. you got to get out of the house. Um, and old Pugs. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you, man. How are you doing, Pugs? You good? Ah, you, thanks you, for asking, man. You said you said to me that just a while back there, Tuesday suck. They do. do they, they do. I, I, I'm finding that they do more and more. Like, I'm pretty good on Mondays because I'm excited to get back to the show. Yeah. Um, and then Tuesdays, you know, it's a lull. I'm not, I'm not for, for goodness sake, I'm not in the wet blanket well, I was on, a bit on of a Friday. Glow, I'll say that about much. your weekend. <laughs> Well, that'll be a heavy MDMA use, wouldn't it, Pug Sun? Because normally you have a terrible Tuesday. That's classic. Oh, oh yeah, the old second day come downs. No, I didn't have MD- any MDMA. Thank you, Mike Minogue. Um, no, I did have a great weekend, Jace. I know, I know you did, mate. It's fantastic. You're a great Don't e- look at me like that yeah, while you no, say I'm that. I'm just it's saying just... you're a great example for us. Listen, listen. I um, I appreciate that you guys, uh, you know, you can acknowledge what it is that you guys want to be working on and stuff like oh, that. Yeah, and that's totally really, obviously, I, I don't have the same relatability, but... Um, I think you guys are in the right right kind of mindset yeah, to be well, where you want to be. Well, I mean, you're great with your, your your pleasures, Jason. What you what you're committed to doing for yourself, you know? Slowly, slowly. It is like, and, and, and but you just need some days behind you. Eh? Yes, because mm. once you get some days, and you're like, wow, I don't want to start again. Yeah. Momentum. Yeah, yeah, totally. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. There you go, New Zealand. There you go. Chat Here's a bit of fucking sucky la la for your Tuesday. Lovely but she's a stuff. battle. There'll be people out there battling. Oh fuck you, man. Yeah. All yeah. over the pro- uh, place. That's the problem. Yeah. I mean, that's where I get half my content from, from the battlers on the street out there who come and say good day to old Hoity J. Well, that's all your personal yeah. stuff, mate. Yeah, you're, yeah. Not, yeah. you're not seeking that out either. It's just kind of finding its way to you everywhere yeah, you Yeah, just sort of do it unbidden. Yeah. Or unbidden. 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 Hey, uh... Unbidden <laughs> erection is normally where you'd find the word yes, unbidden, unbidden, isn't unbidden, it? Yes, unbidden, yes. Yeah. An unbidden erection. Yeah. One of the great one of the great phrases, I think. I think so too. Do you get many unbidden erections, Pugsa? Yeah, I get a few, man. It happens yeah. to the best of us, brother. <laughs> it happens to the best of us, you know what I'm saying? Good shit, mate. Uh, have a geese at the uh, Instagram at Hodaki Big Show. And of course, most importantly, listen to the Hodaki Big Show four to seven every weekdays. Every weekdays? Every weekday. Uh, and check out the YouTube too, right? Jesus. Right. Radio Hodaki on YouTube. Good stuff, Pugsa. Sorry, it's my unbidden erection. <laughs>